Are you an arts graduate? Are you concerned about your future? Well, here's some advice that might help. Anybody who's starting out in any field has difficulty. You might hate the song, but I like it. <laughs> I've failed more times than I've succeeded, but it's the succeeding, the, the times that I've succeeded, that I've built my career around. Most of it has to do with patience and timing. So as an artist, you got to try to find other artists who are just a little bit more established than you. Go read some blogs. There's so much information out there now. You're going to need to save money, right? Because it costs money to live. Here's rule number one, live with your mom. Number two, you're probably going to need to take Marta, all right? Sell your car. You just need a pen and a pad or a script and a camera. You won't be able to afford a camera, though. Don't you let things take hold of you. So I think a lot of it has to do with tweaking a definition of success. If you're going into it to be famous, um, good luck to you. But most people that are really, really famous in this business are people who didn't necessarily go after the fame. It's just kind of a byproduct of their hard work and work ethic. I think that working in a field that you love is way more important and way more satisfying than, you know, being Britney Spears. <laughs> I don't feel quite myself when I'm not in a show or when I'm not involved in something creative, directing, acting, whatever, writing. So that's when I know that the fire still burns. It's because if you don't, if you're not, if you're not in the, in the moment for a while, you know, you kind of, you do kind of lose it. Don't you let things take hold of you. One day you could be happy. You're honing a craft, you're honing a technique, you're cultivating your skills. I always want to do something, even if it's something that doesn't pay very well. And so if it's just like, you know, a little whatever cares patio something gig, it's still an opportunity for somebody to care. It's not, a, it's not a marketing giant or whatever, but there's going to be between 30 and 50, 100 people all night, maybe 10 will care and maybe three will go to the website, get on the email list, buy CD. You never, ever, ever know. I'm singing something somewhere every week. Art at its core is all about risk taking. So if you're not willing to dive off the deep end and see what happens, if you're not willing to fall down a little bit, you'll really never know how far you can go. It's always an experience. I'm always willing to try something. Boy, darling, hear the call. So she Whatever your dreams may be, they're definitely worth pursuing. For anybody who is pursuing this as a profession, don't give up. Stay the course. It's easier said than done. You're going to fail. You're going to be rejected a lot. You have to kind of be aware of the haters. The people who will bring you down because they don't understand. You know, they don't, they don't get what you're trying to do. And that's okay. Those people will be there too. You have to stand on your own two feet. Don't let other people determine who you are or what you should be doing or what your self-esteem should be. That's all up to you. So good luck. She said, now don't make your life to heaven now. You'll never make it out of this alive. No. And don't take your life so serious. you never make it out of this alive. She said, now don't make your life so heavy. You'll never make it out of this alive. No. da 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 da